All right, boys, I got a question for y'all. How cold does the cold start truly when it's 90 degrees outside? Still sounds damn good. What is up, guys? Today you join me uh, in the HPC 427 Cadillac CTSV, and we're going to head up to Cypress for Cypress Cars and Coffee. I haven't been able to make this meeting the past couple months because I've been working, but today I actually switched shift with a coworker. We could make it up there today. So hopefully there's some cool cars, some good sends, and uh, an overall great show. Let's get on up there. We got a 600 naturally aspirated horsepower at our disposal to get us up there quick because we are running a little bit late. Um, but I'm also super tired, so I got to stop and get something uh, to wake me up a little bit first. But we're on our way. shabby boys you know you always gotta love the sound of seven liters of bald eagle american loving joy and freedom and power i don't know where i was going with that boys but i'm exhausted boys ways is truly a lifesaver whenever i'm in a car and i don't have like a radar detector or anything in it Ways sponsor me please we get some police officers coming up, so let's behave. Oh, look, there he is. There he is, right there. <laughs> Thank you, Wiz. I love you. All right, boys, we're about to do a little 60 roll here, I believe. From third. Sixty to sixty-five mile an hour pull. Don't worry about that. See, some people like to uh, go to the gym, stretch their legs, or stretch out, do whatever in the morning. I like to stretch my legs. Alrighty, boys. We got to be careful because there's always a lot of cops just, like pulling into this meet. Especially with like a couple times ago, some 350s, he pulled out and did a donut in the road, so I'm sure the cops are even more heavy now. No full sins coming into the show. Absolutely not. Let's see what we got going on. You like my choppiness? Yes. <laughs> so we had to take the CTSV out and we parked next to a CTSV buddy. It's crazy to see the difference between the NA427 under the hood of this one and then the V over here is crazy rare, crazy cool. We got the old school V wagon, a little Lingenfelter kit on it, the LSA under the hood looking glorious. But of course it is a wagon on top of that, but even further to make this cooler, it's also a manual. Got a manual CTSV wagon. How sick is that? It's for sale as well, I'm pretty sure. How much did you want for your car? $65,000 gets you a manual CTSV wagon. This is quite the hood prop on the old bug. We got a stick of bamboo holding it open. Quite creative. I can't just walk by and ignore a Whipple Terminator. Now can I? Look at that, that's glorious. The old Chevy gang hanging out over here. We got the old school vet and nice old C10. Feeling a little peachy keen out here, boys. Is that a saying? Pretty sure that's a phrase people use. And it's in peach, so I feel like it works. Got some four-door muscle out here, two Caprice PPVs, and then the Chevy SS with the holding badges. Sitting pretty between them. And got some old Camaros here. One on a bead lock out back, that looks crazy. We got this thing over here, the beautiful old Z28. Also on some meat out back. Got an old Jeep J10. A little truck I know very, very little about, but still very cool to see out here on the big old mud and all-terrain tires. We got an old GMC here, which looks to be on some air suspension maybe, with the way it's uh, 
slanted. I don't even know how to put that into words. We got to get the puppies in the video. Hello, my friend. Hi. You are so precious. <laughs> and we're a fan of Ford GTs out here, boys. I can tell you that much. We do love a good old supercharged 5.4 liter Ford motor in a body that looks this good. But this guy has got the big old polished chrome Whipple back here. So we, we like we like Lambo V10s, especially when they're surrounded in purple. But we like Lambo V10s whenever there's turb skis tucked away, hidden from view in that purple bumper. So we got the twin turb ski. UGR Huracan Performante here in Viola Parsa Fay. Oh, what a beautiful, beautiful specimen this is. Next to him, we got the 992 Porsche GT3 looking crazy. These wings on these cars are nuts. We got the big wang built GT2 RS here, the track weapon, and another 911 here. Next to, I believe this is a Goblin. They have the SRT4 motors in the back of the supercharger on them, and they weigh like nothing. What a cool little thing. A little bit of all the color body panels on it. Sounds pretty good though. We got the July 4th American Spec GT350, the red, white, and blue. God bless this beautiful country, boy. Alrighty, boys. I think it is time to go to the exit because we got a Whipple freaking turn me rolling out, boys. and it still sounds so good. So sick. Horsepower GT2 RS. Oh my god. Come on now, brother. You could have done better. You can't follow up that GT2 RS like that. The cops are rolling out in the cam police car. Oh, hell yeah, brother. MS Viper race car with the plexiglass wicker bill.
got the little Quadrifoglio Stelvio in the highest in the room over here with the big old truck. That's a, that's like a mammoth. Yes! That was literally a high schooler driving that thing. What do I gotta do, invest in Dogecoin? You got the Audi gang rolling out. Two RS6s and an RS3. Mom, dad, baby. My boy, Big Yeet. Z07AF rolling out. I think he's nuts. Spicy? Alrighty guys, hopefully y'all enjoyed today's video. Lots of crazy cars, a couple decent sins, and uh, 
and all in all good meat as expected with Cypress Cars and Coffee. Um, we'll be back out again whenever I can and uh, let's send it in the CTSV on the way out. And last but not least, Mr. Drew, Cars Across Texas, baby.